Old Man Winter is on his way, and once he hits, it'll be many cold months of struggling to get your engine started. So right now is the perfect time to prep your diesel engines for our freezing Canadian temperatures. Today on Greg's Test Table, we are going to investigate the best way to remedy the problems. One of the main issues experienced with diesel in the cold is the presence of water and moisture in the fuel tank, turning the diesel into a waxy, gel-like substance, which can stall or even damage your engine. The solution for this is to use a product called Diesel Fuel Conditioner, which removes said moisture from the tank and keeps your fuel from turning into molasses. So, we are going to put six different diesel fuel treatments head to head in order to find out which product is the best option for taking care of your engine. The six products up on the table today are Howe's Diesel Treat, RecoCam's Diesel Fuel Conditioner, Lucas Oil's Cold Weather Diesel Treatment Anti-Gel, Clean Flow's Diesel Fuel Conditioner, Power Service's Diesel Fuel Supplement, and Fuel Power by FPPF. Right away, you've probably noticed that the Fuel Power bottle is tiny in comparison to the others. Well folks, looks can be deceiving. So before we judge a book by its cover, let's compare what these products offer. In this chart, we can see that every product performs the basic functions of preventing fuel gelling, removing moisture, and cleaning your fuel system, with the exception of Lucas Oil's Diesel Anti-Gel. Both Fuel Power and Diesel Treat state that they increase fuel economy, and all except for Power Service and Lucas Oil are designed for use all year round. Fuel Power also has the added benefits of being great for fuel storage, is compatible with both diesel and gasoline, and is the only environmentally friendly product. Still, as long as the product protects your engine, who cares which bottle you buy? Well, let's take a deeper dive into how much product you need to treat your fuel. First, Let's look at the amount of treatable fuel you get out of each bottle. First up, we have Power Service, which can treat 360 liters of fuel. Next is Lucas Oil at 568 liters. The little bottle of fuel power can handle 908 liters. Both RecoChem and CleanFlow treat 2,270 liters. And lastly, Howes can treat 3,600 liters. Now, I'm sure you're thinking that grabbing a bottle of diesel treat will be the best bane for your buck, but hang on a second. Let's get even deeper and find out exactly how much of each product you need to keep your fuel systems clean and moisture free for each liter of fuel. When broken down this way, we can see that with a tiny bottle of fuel power, you only need to use 0.26 milliliters of product per liter of diesel. Both RecoChem and CleanFlow need 0.44 milliliters of product per liter, already almost double that of FPPF. Diesel Treat is up next, needing 0.59 milliliters per liter. But if we take into account that House recommends tripling the dosage when temperatures are below zero degrees Celsius, you may need to use up to 2.22 milliliters of product per liter. Lucas Oil requires 1.67 milliliters of product. And finally, we have Power Service, coming in at a whopping 3.15 milliliters required for each liter of fuel. But on top of that, they also recommend doubling the dose at temperatures under zero degrees taking the total to 6.31 milliliters per liter. When you look at it this way, FPPF's fuel power is the obvious choice. But remember, our main goal with a diesel fuel treatment is to remove any water or moisture that may be in your fuel tank. So, to make sure this is still the best choice, let's put each of these products to work and see which one removes water the best. To do this, we are going to put equal parts, 10 milliliters of water and 10 milliliters of product into each of these jars. 
Then we will give them a good shake to mix the product and water together. All right, the next step is to take this water detection paste, scoop a little bit onto a stick, and submerge it into the combined mixtures. If there is any water or moisture left in the jar, this paste will turn red. But if no moisture is present, the paste will remain unchanged. Time to see how they all stack up. RecoChem came in last place, with the paste turning a very bright red, and appeared to have a weird chemical reaction on the surface. In fifth place is Power Service, with half of the submerged paste turning bright red, and even showing a visible line where the chemical and water separated. Fourth is House, with the tip turning bright red, indicating that the chemical pushed the water to the bottom of the jar. Lucas Oil came in third, having similar results to Howe's, but turning a lighter shade of red. Second place goes to CleanFlow, which appeared to not have any color changes, but over the course of five minutes turned to a light shade of red, indicating a lingering presence of water in the jar. And the gold medal champion is FPPF, being the only jar containing absolutely no moisture. To verify our findings, we also tested the products again after letting them sit for 24 hours. The results were nearly identical, with the main difference being a change in how red the paste turned. All except for FPPF, of course, which still remained the only solution to have no color change whatsoever. The reason for this is that all except one of these products simply disperse the moisture. So yes, it may seem to temporarily fix your issue, but once it settles, the water will reform, bringing back the same problems from before you added the treatment. FPPF's fuel power, to get a little sciency, utilizes a fascinating process called hydrogen polar bonding. At the molecular level, this chemical will break apart the water's hydrogen and oxygen molecules and bond itself to the hydrogen ensuring that the oxygen cannot rebond with it, removing any and all moisture from your fuel and the tank. And since hydrogen is extremely good at combusting, this new mixture will burn cleanly with your fuel, leaving your engine running like new. But wait, there's more. FPPF designed this bottle to be perfect for all you truckers out there who brave the icy roads. Most semi-trucks have two fuel reservoirs. With this bottle, you won't need to perform any calculations when you're out in the freezing cold. Just pour half a bottle into each tank. 
Now you can get back into your nice warm cab and not have to worry about your engine giving you any fuss or freezing your fingers off. Fuel power is not only good during the cold, however. Since this product also cleans your fuel system, it can be used all year round to keep your engine in tip-top shape. And don't forget, this works with regular gasoline as well. Perfect for getting the Jenny ready for your next camping trip, bringing your hot rod out of storage after the winter, or ensuring that lawnmower of yours isn't gonna give you any complaints when you try to start it. If all of that didn't convince you, I don't know what will. We also carry a wide range of FPPF chemicals, from Meltdown SOS for emergencies when your fuel gels up, to super concentrated up your gas for cleaning injectors and boosting octane, and oh, Canada, so much more. But if you don't know which product you need or just need to pick up a bottle of fuel power, come on down to Greg's or give us a call and we'll be sure to help you out. Thanks for tuning in to Greg's Test Table. Have a great Canadian day.